Item number SCP-843. Index Cow Seeds. Object class Euclid. Special containment procedures. All three contained instances of SCP-843-1 are to be stored in their original packaging within an airtight container. Should any unusual sounds be heard from within the container, D-Class personnel armed with flamethrowers are to enter and cleanse the area. SCP-843-2 is to remain in an enclosed pen, with D-Class personnel entering every 12 hours to supply grain and water. Any instance of SCP-843-1 or SCP-843-2 in the wild are to be reported and destroyed. Description SCP-843-1 appears to be a seed of Aziolus lunatus lima bean, painted white with black spots to resemble a typical Holstein cattle's coat. The original packaging for SCP-843-1 contained five of these seeds, as well as a piece of paper proclaiming the items within to be cow seeds. SCP-843-1 is itself harmless, though when planted within five days, SCP-843-2 will manifest. SCP-843-2 is a creature similar to a typical Holstein cattle, save that it is composed entirely of an unknown plant matter. At first, SCP-843-2 is much like a young calf and is rooted to the soil it sprouted from. However, at anywhere between 5 and 10 days, the calf will uproot itself and begin to grow at times the rate of a normal calf. After uprooting, SCP-843-2 will grow increasingly aggressive. As there is only one instance of SCP-843-2 in containment, it is not known how or even if SCP-843-2 reproduces, or how SCP-843-1 is formed. It is currently theorized that data expunged. SCP-843 was purchased on by agent in a rural town in Two seeds were planted in her garden and soon sprouted, showcasing SCP-843-2. Reported and was able to contain one instance of SCP-843-2. However, the second escaped into rural Addendum Agent reported that the store she purchased the item from apparently had a couple of displays full of the things, and many people were interested in them. A recovery team was sent to the location, provided, but found that the store had been the victim of a faulty electric system and had burnt to the ground. All records of transactions have proven to be inaccessible, as the store was cash only and had no computer-based record of transactions. As such, Mobile Task Force Upsilon 2, Kettle Wranglers, has been established, searching for and containing more instances of SCP-843-2.